guys, welcome back. Today we're doing the unboxing for the Allure Beauty Box. I have never done this one, so it's gonna be super exciting. I don't have a clue what's in here, so if you're excited like I'm excited, then stick around. This is where it's gonna happen. Hi guys, like I said a second ago, uh, this is a book, a box I have never done before. I haven't seen any videos. I've avoided well, I them. knew it was on its way, but that's about it. I have avoided all info about this because I wanted to be excited because it's new and I've, I've seen mixed reviews on this before in the past, but they have recently redone this box and kind of updated and changed things. So I don't know how it was before, but I want to have an unbiased real reaction today on this without any pre-existing knowledge. It is $15, but if you it's your very first month ever, you get $5 off. So it's $10 the first month, but then it's gonna be 15 every month. And it says that you get 50 to $90 worth of stuff for that $15. So it's gonna have deluxe items, it said, samples, things like that in here, but they really pushed the whole deluxe word in there. I felt like that was a key word in the sentence. So, I'm excited to see what's in here. $10 this first month, and then it'll be 15 after that. Pink on the inside, really pretty pink. It just says hashtag Allure Beauty Box. Am I saying that right? Allure, Allure. Allure. I don't know, it just sounds like I'm saying it wrong. Inside, you get a booklet of all the items that you got. And I don't know if it actually says the prices. It does say the full size price for them. And then, savings that glow tips and tricks about the items and then it has like editors notes and stuff but i don't want to look too closely at that because i'm still really excited to open this so let's do it first of all it comes in this so it came in the box with the pink inside of it there's a card in there i gotta check it out but and then it comes in this neon little flip top makeup bag how cute that is all packaged I really like their real benefit their their real mascara beyond mask does that mean it's in like black what color are you it's their real cute packaging i know i like this brand this brand is something i have used for years I hate these because I'm really, really clumsy. Can you see those jagged little eyeball killers? Uh, these hurt, but I will try it because I I love mascara. Mas mascara is kind of my, my thing because I have really nice eyelashes and I refuse to get extensions because I hated them before. So now I'm just trying to accentuate what I already have naturally. So if this is good, I'll let you know. I'm definitely going to try it because I love trying different mascaras and I am going to try it. I just am. That's how it is. Cargo Cosmetics. I don't have anything by Cargo Cosmetics, but I've seen things by Cargo Cosmetics, and they have really cute packaging. Look at that cute, just black and white little churchy village thing going on. And it's in the color Punta Cana. Punta Cana? Punta Cana? I feel like I'm swearing. Can somebody tell me what that means? Because it, it doesn't sound like I should be saying Punta Cana or Punta Cana. Either way, I, I, it feels wrong. Ooh, the packaging is like aluminum. And then it says in Punta Cana. And it just says Cargo Cosmetics. Whoa. So it's like a fuchsia-y red. I don't feel like it's red and I don't feel like it's fuchsia. I feel it like it's right in the middle. Bam! Look at that though. It's super creamy. All right, we're going in. Okay, uh, I'll play with it. I think it's gonna need a lip liner, but I definitely will try the Era Alpine Berry Water Cream, Hydrate and Glow. It's in the cutest little package. Okay, Hydrate and Glow. Crafted from seed to skin. Ooh, forgot I was wearing that lipstick for a second. Oh, it's one of those packages where you think you're getting a whole bunch, but then it's like less than a chapstick's worth of containerness. Yeah, it's 0.16 fluid ounces or five mils, which is like a medicine cup, the smallest line on the medicine cup 
for kids like liquid medications. Ooh, smells really fresh. I really like that. So I will try this. I'll keep you guys posted. Multi-eye eye serum mask. So here's a single use eye mask. There are two of them in there, so it's one single session. A silky all-in-one hydrogel patch formulated with a powerhouse of ingredients to tackle the major signs of under eye, dark circles, puffiness, fine lines, and wrinkles. Whew. There we go. There it is. Pretty packaging, pinky foily stuff, and I love stuff. Ooh, this is fun packaging. Oh, I've wanted to try one of these. I'm really excited. It's a mini makeup eraser. Erase all makeup with just water equal to 3,600 makeup wipes. If I could stop using makeup wipes, I would love that because I have sensitive eyes. I'm excited, what color is it? Ooh, it's black and it's the mini. I don't know what the full size looks like. Does anybody know? Do they have this? It just smells like fabric. Ritzy Cosmetics Liquid Beam Multi-Purpose Liquid Illuminator. So liquid illuminators, not a big fan. Gonna be honest, not a big fan at all. I might end up putting this in the giveaway. I will not open it if I do that, so I'll just kind of look. Yeah, that's not my type of product. This settles into my my lines, because I have them, let's be honest, I'm I, they're there. Um, I'm not gonna use this because of that, so I will put this in the giveaway bin, but it is the R La Ritzy Cosmetics Liquid Beam. It's really pretty. I just know my skin, I know my texture down here is really, really bad really bad up here so if I'm not insanely careful with something like this which I don't want to have to be overly careful then I just don't reach for this type of stuff I, I just don't I reach for stuff that's not going to accentuate my old lady skin last item is the Nuria defend triple action eye cream oh I love eye cream mulberry root and ginseng ginseng is supposed to be really good for tired mom eyes or tired anybody eyes I have heard people do ginseng tea bags with green tea and ginseng or something and they put them under their eyes and as patches I don't know I've been thinking about trying something like that oh so it is extra secure in that packaging it's not going anywhere for a plastic tube it seems like a decent size I wonder if this is their full size or if it's a deluxe sample this seems pretty right on for the size of an eye, a full-size eye cream but I'm excited to try it. I like the colors whoa Okay, I've never tried an eye cream with one of those kind of things, but they're meant to, you're supposed to be able to just swipe it on your eye right there in the in the under eye and really get into the grooves. But I just wanna see what the product looks like. Oh, again, it just smells fresh. More in a fragranty uh, floral way. Yeah, more of a floral, less of a essentially, but it's still an essentially floral, not a fake overly <laughs> floral where you're like, grandma, back off on the nozzle. Uh, yeah, that's not this kind of smell. This is a fresh perfumey, but not overwhelming. I would use it and I'm pretty sensitive. This month, for the items I got and for the prices I'm running in my head as far as the math goes, I feel like this was a good deal for $10. This feels like a more skin-based Ipsy to me. I, I dig it. Hello Fresh, New Year Fresh You, $60 gift card. I actually think I'm gonna do this, but I think I'm gonna go through one of the YouTubers that I really love. I'm gonna use probably one of their subscriptions because I'd like to support the ones that I follow and appreciate because I think that's kind of a payback for them for making content that I like to binge and watch. I will put everything back in this box. I will put the stuff in my bathroom where it needs to go so I can use it. And I will put this in the giveaway bin for you guys as well while I'm putting everything away. And I hope you guys are happy, having a happy weekday and that your kids aren't driving you crazy and that everybody is happy and healthy and fun. Please like and subscribe. Talk to you guys later. Peace.